against you, 1 0 win over Siren Sester here in the FA Trophy. Uh, your thoughts on the game? A tough game. Uh, pitch was a little bit heavy. Uh, I thought we started very well, started very bright, um, created a couple of good chances, got a goal. Um, yeah, we, we were a bit disappointed we couldn't get the second goal. We, we had a few good chances after that in the first half. Um, second half, not our best performance, a little bit scrappy. I thought the game was scrappy. Um, 1 0 victory, it, it, it was strange. We didn't play well second half, but we had the best two chances and we were largely untroubled, so it kind of cancelled each other out second half. And do you, did you think really Luke in goal didn't really have much at all to really save? So it never really looked any in doubt. Of it he, he, yeah, I think that's probably a fair comment. He, he wasn't he wasn't um, troubled too much in terms of chances. A couple of good bits of handling first half, um, but again, that wasn't necessary through shots. Was, you know, so um, yeah. Listen, he, he's come and done really well. Uh, we look solid. It's nice to get a clean sheet. I think that's really important for the boys at the back today. That's back to back wins now. I know it's a different competition, but how important is that to stop them have wins more? Obviously, getting wins in, in a row, really, because that's been our issue, really, this season. has been you're getting a good result and then not played for a while, and then obviously perhaps losing again and then winning it. Is, is, quite, is it nice to get that almost back to back wins again? Uh, absolutely. Football is about momentum, and uh, winning games of football kind of gives you that momentum, uh, gives you confidence, gives the players that, that kind of. You know that, that little bit of positivity going into the next game. So, so that's important for us. Look, look, we want to do well this year in this competition. Um, you know, we've, we've, we've played, we've gone as strong as we, we, we could. Um, so, so yes, it's massively important. It's, it's important we kick on now and turn it into three, four wins, sort of thing. So, you know, we, I think a couple of times a season we've had one or two on the trot. You know, and it's about getting a little run together. That's what we need. And as a striker yourself, it's always nice to see a young striker, you, and obviously coming in to the squad now, and uh, another goal for him tonight. It's a nice, good finish from him. Yeah, listen, I, I, absolutely. He works his he works his socks off. You know, gets just reward for you know, dare I say, tapping, being in the right area at the right time. Um, so really pleased for him. Uh, he's starting to find his feet now, uh, and, and you know, we're, we're expecting expecting more from him in the coming weeks. And now, now we know our opponents, which is a bit of a different one. We actually know our opponents in the next round of this. Bognor Regis yeah. here. We don't know whether it's going to be Saturday, Tuesday, Friday, whenever. But um, a team of, of, you know, obviously, you know Bognor, you've played them before in the past, but it's going to be a yeah. tough game. Yeah, I mean, look, they're, they're obviously there's it's a long way to travel. I mean, but based on what happened last time when both us and Parkway were at home, the, the fixture was arranged for a Sunday. Uh, so not that I know that yet, but but I would imagine yeah, we're looking largely at it being a Sunday game. Um, no doubt they'll present uh, you know a different challenge for us. We'll, we'll do our homework on them beforehand, um, and again we'll, we'll look to look to do our very best in the next round and kick on.